today we are replacing the mast boot for the second time. We bought this one and we sealed it with Sikaflex. And Sikaflex, we usually use 3M4200 for sealing things, but this time we use Sikaflex. And the advantages and disadvantages of Sikaflex is it never really cures, so it stays somewhat liquid. Well, you can call it highly viscous, but liquid nonetheless. And I think in this application, that's part of why this failed and we had leaks coming down into the cabin. I already started this, so here's the old mast boot coming off. And we've got wedges in here. Of course, there was a band clamp around it holding the boot in place. So now I have the fun job of cleaning all the gook tape that we'd put on because it was leaking and caulk and everything away. Okay, we are all nice and clean, polished, degreased. Now we're going to be using Tommy Tape Mast Boot Wrap. You can get this on Amazon. There's no instructions that come with the package, but there are some online. The first thing the instructions say to do is to measure out one turn. plus a little extra. Ooh, this is tough stuff. It doesn't want to cut. Okay. That was not crazy. <laughs> This is also a good opportunity to make sure your wedges are in good and tight. And I'll let our friends over at the uh, Rigging Doctor, who have an excellent video on how to do that, explain how to do your wedges. Okay, unfortunately, unfortunately it got some dirt in here, so I'm gonna but just on the tail end, so I'm gonna just cut that off. I got a wrinkle, that's okay. Okay, one layer all the way around. I gotta be careful with the garbage, the wind's picking up out here. Such is the way of fi fixing sailboats. I gotta, I gotta close up this whole gap. So I'm gonna pull it very tight as I go around.
Okay, that's twice around the base. Now I'll start working my way up. Well, obviously you have to cut off the bit where the cardboard tube was. Well, I don't know about you, but I think that looks pretty good. Check back in a year and see how it fares. Alright, thanks for watching.